A couple questions have arisen uh, from new customers. They'll get our ball joint and the pin uh, feels a little loose. There's a little bit of slot you can see here. There's no grease in there. there. There's a grease clearance that needs to be around the pin, between the pin and the race. It's about two thou or so. It, uh, it will allow a little slot if you listen. You can hear it click and you can kind of see the movement back and forth. When you put grease in here, it actually all locks up. If you don't have that play, then the grease doesn't make it around this lip here. It doesn't pass past here, down here, and grease this area. Uh, if that happens, then this dries out and it galls and it'll cause stiff steering. The cause for alarm is because of the normal style of ball joint, uh, which is this. This is a factory or a Moog joint, I'm not sure which, but uh, this is the actual construction of it. And you can see how this one moves back and forth. So I understand the fear of a loose pin and death wobble. But as you can see from the top, there's quite a bit of room there and this head isn't supported by this chamber. The, pin, the only thing supporting it is the bushing around the pin. When you hit a bump really hard, it'll bang it back and forth. It'll loosen the little Babbitt bushing in here, and that's where you get your play. With ours, the head and the main shaft have the same clearance uh, between the upper chamber and the lower chamber. So the upper part is supported by the lower part, or the upper part is supported by the wall, from the upper chamber and the pin is supported in the lower chamber. So even if you hit, have a little bit of play, when you bolt your knuckle up, it's gonna be very solid and it's gonna turn really nice and smooth. You won't have any play. Thank you.